Hi, I'm Lindsay Ann, and today I'm going to show you some great tricks for measuring your solid fats like butter, margarine, and shortening. While liquid fats like oil, liquid margarine, or melted butter should be measured in a liquid measuring cup, solid fats are measured a little bit differently. The most accurate way to measure your ingredient is by using a kitchen scale. If you don't have one of these, you can use the pre-measured marks on the side of the wrapper if your ingredient is in stick form. I end up measuring it out anyway after I cut it just to make sure it's accurate. But if your ingredient comes in a tub like margarine or shortening, it can get a little trickier. Um, one method that's really cool is by covering and lining your measuring cup with saran wrap. And what you're going to do is just push your ingredient into the cup and make sure you're pressing down to release any air pockets that can get trapped in there. And once it's full and overflowing, you can take the edge, the back side of a knife and just scrape it off to level it. And the cool part is it just comes right out with the saran wrap. And you can do this without saran wrap. This way is just a little cleaner and easier. And there's your half a cup of butter, margarine. Um, another really cool trick, here's a little science lesson for you, is the liquid displacement method. So let's say your recipe calls for a quarter cup of shortening. What you can do is fill your cup with one cup of water. And then you're just gonna add enough shortening until it reaches the one and one quarter mark. So there we are at one and a quarter cup. So since you know one cup of that is water, the other quarter cup is your shortening. So go ahead and use it in your recipe. And there you have a ton of different ways to measure your ingredients. So go ahead and use whichever method you like. And for more videos in my Baking 101 series, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel or connect with me online for more fun baking tips, recipes, and ideas. Thanks for stopping by my Dollhouse Bake Shop. See you guys next time.